this is Bob with RealTVFilms.com. We're here at Hollywood Billiards in Hollywood, California, covering the Beverly Hills Shorts Festival. I ran into some old friends. I like saying old friends. We met in Park City. Nice to see you guys again. Heyman and Eric Bush. Gentlemen, pleasure to see you. The Donna Verde Junior High is a short film uh, about a nerdy junior high school kid who uh, he, he finds kind of uh, fortune and fame by hustling banned sodas in school. Uh, they took the vending machines out of school, so he starts hustling sodas and becomes popular amongst the kids. So. Perfect. Now, now you're an actor in this film? I am an actor, producer. Uh, my acting role, I play the father of the Don. So my kid's the one that's selling the sodas and snacks and stuff at school. Mm -hmm. Terrific. Now, um, I saw you guys in Park City. Right. Tell me a little bit about Park City and the experience you had there. Uh, well, we were in a, uh, a, a festival called CineSlam Park City. Uh, you know, uh, Park City, it's, it, there's three festivals, Sundance going on, Slam Dance, and a new film festival, it was like it was the second year, uh, called CineSlam. So we were in CineSlam. And so we were out there, you know, networking our, our film, our short, uh, and it was... Uh, so we, we did, and that's where we met you, uh, you know, because you were out there interviewing. Right. And uh, in fact, it was at was it at Kinko's? Yeah, or, or something, something like that. Yeah, because we were making more flyers <laughs> so that we can pass it out to people uh, in negative eight degree weather. And um, <laughs> yep. so, and we were out there network film, and it was a good, it was a, it was a great experience to screen our film there because everybody was there. And now we're in development for the feature version of the film because of that uh, experience out there. So uh, we we've been meeting with investors for the feature all week, and uh, so we're kind of really excited. Wow, that, that's terrific. Now, uh, you're the writer, the director. Right. Where'd you get Where'd you get inspired to write this story? Tell me a little uh, about that. Well, the story is it's kind of it's pretty much based on a true story. Uh, one of his best friends that he grew up with, uh, he's you know the stepfather of this kid that that I wrote the story off after. He's this he was a, a very smart kid. I don't want to say nerdy. He's just very smart, and he doesn't have that many friends, right? Uh, and when you know it did go around in the L.A. County schools, they 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 took out a lot of the vending machines because of childhood obesity. And so he was, to him, it was, you know, he, to him, the, for the same price of uh, two sodas in a vending machine, he can buy a crate of sodas at Costco, you know. Right. So he bought a crate of sodas, and, and next thing you know, he just became popular because he was selling sodas for a dollar, and he was just happy to have friends talking to him, uh, or people talking to him instead of, he didn't care about the money, he had a whole suitcase of money and didn't care about it, he just had new friends. So right. that's the, the prim that's what the story is based off of. Now, uh, Eric, what I find out a lot with short films or even films in general is that when people are independently doing them, they have to wear a couple of hats. Mm -hmm. I know you were the actor as well as the producer of this mm -hmm. film. Tell me, was that a, you had to gather all the money? How did, tell me a little bit about doing that. Wow. Uh, <laughs> so, so it, it's probably a tough road, and it, it's more than you can fill in in a minute or so. But oh, yeah, yeah, I, I, I'll try to make it brief. Yeah, um, I think it was tough be, because uh, you know obviously you went you wearing you know a couple of hats or whatever, and I'd always done you know tons of acting before, and so I was just like, well, I want to focus on you know producing because you know I want to make sure I had everything right, and so it was just it was just hectic trying to make sure you know in the shoot days that everything was taken care of and stuff like that. And then I had to you know learn my lines and stuff, so. So that part was kind of trying to, I guess, have a split focus maybe, you know, on, on, you know, on a couple of days of that. But um, other than that, you know, we, we all teamed up and, and, and hung in there and uh, made it happen. Now, um, this isn't the only festival. This it was part of uh, the festival in Park City, but right. now you're going on to do other things with this film as well, right? right. Well, we it, this is like our third, is it a fourth film festival? A uh, fourth film festival. Uh, we were in you know LA, I don't should I name it? Well, LA Shorts Festival. Uh, uh, we were just in fact we were just in the Pan African Film Festival, and we actually won audience favorite film. We just won that last Congrats. Monday. Thanks. And so uh, so now we were in this film festival, the Beverly Hills uh, Shorts Film Fest, and there's gonna we've already there's gonna be a few more down the line as well. It looks like every month uh, a couple of film festivals it seems. Well gentlemen it's been a pleasure talking to you today. Best of success to you. It Thank sounds you like this much. film's on a, I mean you've already, like you said, you're, go, you're gonna move on and make a movie out right. of this, right? Make a movie out of it now. Does the screenplay's finished. Anybody else want to invest? Let us know. <laughs> <laughs> Where can they go? Was there a website out there? Yeah. You, can, you can find me on MySpace. Uh, no, <laughs> you can find us, uh, well our film, our production company is called Rising Nile Productions, you know like the Nile River, Rising Nile Productions. So you can just go to myspace.com com backslash rising now productions find us and uh we can go from there you know preteen movie uh or no tween movie uh you know very marketable you know that's what's going on that's what we've been sitting down with well perfect gentlemen <laughs> pleasure to meet you oh, yeah. thank all you right. very much yeah. nice to meet you too good to see you all right, all right.